caution, this video contains sensitive subject matter and views you may not agree with. Please keep an open mind and respect others' views. I'm back! And I'm riding, and I'm recording. So, um, I have something planned for you guys this week. It's, uh, I, I want to talk to you guys about all this political bullshit that's been fucking going around. So, um, yeah, it's getting kind of fucking ridiculous right now. Um, I'll link to my last video I talked about politics and a better voting system. And if you guys haven't seen that video, um, let me just go over it real quick. You guys can watch it and get the full details. But I, I gave an idea for what seems to be the perfect voting system. Because there's absolutely no bias. Well, I can't say that. You may be biased towards a certain plan or whatever the hell it may be. You may be biased towards some laws that they have ideas for, but you're not going to be biased towards the person. Like, let's say my voting plan went and it's actually starting to work. People are using it. And let's say we're using it this year for uh, Hillary and Donald. What this would do is you wouldn't know if Hillary's a female, you wouldn't know if she's a male, you wouldn't know if Hillary or if Donald was a female or a male, you wouldn't know anything about them other than they're running for president. You wouldn't know if they're Democrat, Republican, Independent, none of that bullshit because really, Democrat, Republican, and all that is just fucking bullshit. If you say you're a fucking Democrat, fuck you. If you say you're a Republican, fuck you. If you say you're independent, fuck you. I say I'm independent and I say fuck me because that's kind of bullshit. Um, really, it shouldn't matter what our plans are or what our... Uh, how am I putting this? It doesn't really matter what the fuck you think you believe in. You should not have to say, I'm a Republican or I'm a Democrat or I'm independent. You shouldn't have to fucking say that because that is a stupid ass fucking name that they gave people. And that's it. It, it. I mean, it has no, like, fucking structure or backing other than it gives people money. That's it. But honestly, I don't believe we should be doing that. Uh, we shouldn't be voting president based on their fucking tax returns. We shouldn't be voting for a president on any, I need to open my hood, on any of that shit. What we should be voting for a president for is who makes the most sense to be president. I want to know what their plans are, what they're going to do to fix what's wrong with us right now. I can give a shit if you're black, white, Asian, fucking, I don't give a fuck. A Mexican, I don't care if you're male, female, I don't care if you're fucking post-op transgender son of a bitch. I don't give a fuck. And it, it, it pisses me off because I don't talk about my political beliefs with anyone ever. Um, but when I see this shit, and I, I see it going on so much, it pisses me off. People don't like Trump based off of bullshit. People don't like Hillary based off bullshit. I mean, yeah, she shouldn't have fucking leaked shit, and Donald shouldn't say the shit he says. But nonetheless, we should be caring about... Well, uh, another good point for this is... If you're going to be president, yeah, you have to have a fucking clean record. I don't want any more of this, oh, I'm running for president because I'm rich, or I'm running for president because my husband was president, or my wife was president, or whatever the fuck it may be. I, I don't want to see this shit anymore. We need to implement a better voting system. And I, I rewatched. I don't know if you guys watch Adam Ruins Everything on TV, but I love his fucking show. I need to stop swearing. I just realized that. Um, I love Adam Ruins Everything. His show is awesome, and he does one on voting, and he talks about how broken our voting system is. Our voting system is screwed up bad. Like, we really need to fix our voting system. It, it's outdated. It doesn't work. It just does not work anymore. That and... <laughs> 
there are people out there that still believe that your votes fucking actually do something. Like, one vote for Trump is a vote for Trump. That's not fucking true. Or one vote for Hillary. Whoever the fuck you're voting for, I'm not voting because I really think this whole election is a joke. But, I mean, hell, if I have to vote, I'll vote independent because I was looking up on the guy running right now and he seems pretty okay. I don't agree with everything, but fuck, he's just leagues better than the fucking two that are in the mainstream right now. But, um... Oh, what the fuck was I saying? I forgot what I was saying. Look at that shit. Oh, well. I'll remember. But... Oh, oh, Adam ruins everything. That's what I was talking about. See? I knew I'd remember. So, he talks about how outdated it is. I was talking about the goddamn electoral college. So, if you guys don't know, the electoral college literally is what all our votes go through. It's not some, it's not like one vote for Trump or one vote for Hillary is a vote for either of them. No, that's not true. All our votes do is show the electoral college who we want as president, but that's not how it will turn out. And we've seen this with the Bush election, when it, he didn't fucking win. <laughs> he did not win. He had less votes than his uh, than his uh, 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 rival. But the Electoral College wanted him in because his dad was president and everything else, so they voted him in. That's how the Electoral College works, in a nutshell. Um... It, it's it's broken. It's a broken piece of garbage, and we really need to fix it because anybody that thinks that the Electoral College is a good thing is an idiot. It was a good thing back in the 1800s and earlier. Not fucking anymore. <laughs> it, it's been broke for a long time, and we need to fix this, like, ASAP. Because it's not going to do anything good for us if we keep letting them choose who our president's going to be instead of the people actually choosing. The people don't choose. I'm sorry to tell you. Unless you're a person of power that can get in and work with the Electoral College, it's not going to do anything for us. And I know there's people out there that don't believe the Electoral College makes these calls, but it's the truth. The Electoral College makes these calls, and it's been proven. Like, they even came out and said they make the freaking calls. Not, not us. We simply suggest who we want our president to be. That's all we do. And I don't mean we should stop voting. We should. Because, yeah, it does influence some sort of... God, it is dusty. This shit is so freaking soft. It's, like, just sliding all over the place. But that doesn't mean that we should be freaking... That we should just stop voting. That's that's not what we should do. We need to vote still. Because it still gives them... Hey, you know what? They do like him. Because there are people in the Electoral College, I'm not saying they're all corrupt bastards, but a lot of them are. But the ones that aren't are the ones that look at our votes and go, you know what? Maybe they're right. Maybe we really should think about this president. Or think about having them as a president. But that's all I wanted to say about that. If you guys want to know more, I suggest you guys go watch that Adam Ruins Everything episode. Or go back and watch my... uh, go back and watch my video on it 